In this high energy episode of Redefine, I show how to navigate fill light when photographing your subjects pretty much anywhere when you don't have an assistant. Adorama TV presents The Redefine Show with Tamara Lackey, bringing fresh ideas and equipment favorites. You can check out much more content with photographers by watching Adorama TV. Hi, I'm Tamara Lackey with The Redefine Show for Adorama TV. Today we'll be showing how to photograph a small group or a family in an anywhere type location situation by managing simple effective posing and using a fill light on your own when you're shooting without an assistant. Okay, so one of the questions I get often is how to use a reflector when it's just you, when you don't have an assistant. Um, we have this gorgeous family of three that we're outside, and I want to show how you can not only use a reflector with one person or two people, but three people. Um, when you're doing just a simple, easy pose where the whole point is to show, show a great shot of them all together, um, and to be able to use a reflector. This is a 42-inch reflector. It's well, well used and well loved. I'm using the Westcott Brewstorn Muslin Reflector, which is a favorite reflector of mine. It's a 42 inch round square combo deal that has a soft silver back on one side and unbleached muslin on the other side. I love this because it can produce a slight touch of warmth in every portrait I shoot. And I use it on pretty much every shoot I do. But uh, just how I would use this on a, on a fairly cloudy day, um, to reflect some light back in them. I don't need a whole bunch, but mostly I want to make sure I get catch lights and I want to fill in any sort of shadows with some sort of, even though we have a nice soft diffuse light that's bouncing around everywhere, especially if you notice here on a gray concrete ground, which is a fantastic reflector, um, I'm going to ask them to go lower to the ground so I'll get some bounce naturally. And then I'm going to add the silver side of the reflector to fill in any extra shadows and to make the catch lights really pop. This is Tamara Lackey. Be sure to check out Adorama's latest contest to win some fabulous prizes. Okay, Dolly, girl, come here. Daisy. We're in. All right, so Daisy, if you could do me a favor and simply, you're going to start with you, and if you can just kind of stay like this. Okay. Just start with you first. And then, um, <laughs> and then Bertie, you're going to sit here and lean into Mommy. To Mum. Is it Mommy or Mum? Mummy. Mummy. It's both. Yeah. All right. Dolly, come here, girl. Come here. Who's the good girl? Come here. Come here. Nice. All right. Ready? Come in. And we're going to have you right like this. Okay. So for the simplicity of a pose, um, we don't want, like, we want a triangle pose, but we don't want everybody exactly symmetrical. So, Bertie, can you sit up a little bit taller? Yep. And lean in. Wait. Stay. And lean in a little bit taller. Okay, that's actually good. So if she's going to be up like that, then you can be a little lower. Go ahead and slump back down how you were comfy. No, not like that. You have bones. <laughs> just like this. And then little things I love to do before any photograph is just adjust if you see a little clasp or something. So yeah, pretty. Okay? <laughs> and then if you can come and see, check out exactly how their faces look like now. Again, we've got catch lights. They're soft but it's because we've got the soft diffuse light with the clouds and this light gray brown. Um, let's look, take a look at their faces now. And then when I add this, so it's just a little bit of a hint. I'm gonna go in tight on them so I can hold the reflector up. So take a look at Birdie's face. Birdie, watch this, with it, without it, with it. Take a look at mommy's face, Daisy, without. With. It just brightens up, it adds some nice catch lights, it, it, it brings in the shadows, and I can comfortably hold it while I photograph them from here. So I'm going to adjust my ISO um, to be about ISO 400, 1 3 20th for uh, shutter speed, and a 4 0 for aperture. All right, ready, Dolly? Dolly? Miss Molly? Are you getting restless? Is that what I'm getting from you? Restlessness? Restless leg body syndrome? Watch this. You hold it. You hold it. Perfect. Perfect. Do not let it go. Stay with me. Stay with me. You too, lady. <laughs> me. Okay. Now release it. It looks like you're going potty. <laughs> That's okay. We're just doing reflector work. It's okay if you look like a monster. Watch this. Birdie, can you do it? No, no, I can't do that. All right, that's excellent. That's my favorite look from you. All right, do me a favor. You two just look at each other. Really close. 
Really close. Wait, Dolly, hold your hair. Go, put your hair behind your ear. Yep. All right, now really close without smashing each other's faces. Just go nose to nose. No, no, don't smash. Don't smash. Don't smash. Bertie, your face is smashed. Beautiful. Thank you. What'd you say? And there you go, how to photograph a small group or family on your own by managing the posing and fill light yourself. Join me here next time on Redefine Show for Adorama TV. And don't forget to subscribe to Adorama TV for a bunch of other excellent content. See you soon. Do you want great looking prints at low cost? Be sure to visit our easy to use online printing service. Adorama Pix has professionals who treat your images with the utmost care that you can count on. For a quick turnaround on photos, cards, or albums, use adoramapix.com.